A lot has changed since our inaugural Benson Society Gala four years ago, both in CU and in our world. What has remained consistent, however, is CU's mission to public service, to healthcare, to research, and to education. And that commitment starts with our university's leadership. I am pleased now to introduce someone who is the epitome of that very leadership. Someone who holds CU both personally and professionally very close to his heart. President Todd Salaman has been a fixture of that very leadership for over a decade during his time at CU. He believes that one of CU's primary missions and goals is to help students graduate and succeed so that they can go on and venture and benefit the world around them, not just in our community or our state, but also at large. I know because I am one of the students that has benefited from his vision and because of his work and the hard work that starts with the vision and the promise of leaders just like him. So please, I am deeply honored to bring to the stage and introduce you to all to President Todd Salaman. Are you ready? Hey. Well, how about that, huh? How about Serene? So, um, so we met at a place you might not expect us to meet. So uh, we met at the State Fair. <laughs> like a year ago or so, I think Regent Kroll was there. And I can't remember who else was there, but I, when, I, when I met you, I knew you were something special. And, there, and um, you were there wearing your, whatever it is that you had on that, <laughs> your, your pageantry stuff. And, and, um, and I knew that, that you were going to go places. And it's an incredible thing. So, so when's the last time we had a Rhodes Scholar before you? It was like, it was like 15 years or something, I think. So, so, so not only are you the first woman and the first person of color, but you were the first one for quite a long time. So, so what a wonderful thing. And um, we're so glad that you're here. Thank you. Thank you. 